Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm gonna do a Dollar Tree haul for you today. I had to go to the doctor in Moultrie, which is about 30 minutes from my house, 40 minutes, something like that. And they have a Dollar Tree over there. So I went to that one because I was specifically looking for my daughter's breakfast cookies. She eats these cookies every morning, three or four of them with her morning coffee, these ginger snaps, so she can take her morning medicine before she goes to work. And believe it or not, they didn't have these in Moultrie. So when we came home, we went through Adele. They have a Dollar Tree, so I stopped there and they had plenty. So the first thing I'll show you is these ginger snaps are $1.25 a bag for a 10 ounce bag. And uh, like I said, $1.25 and I got her six bags. And I make her, I keep them in a bag, in, a, in the bag they come in, like this. And I'll set this on her bed, because I love them things, and I don't want to be tempted to eat them. So I'll set them on her bed, and she keeps them in her room, because <clears throat> I don't want to be tempted. And I'm afraid I'll be weak and get into them. Then I don't know what I got at the Moultrie store, or the Dollar, uh, at the, or the Adele store, but they're all Dollar Tree. Um, Tony wanted me to look for a Frisbee for the girls so he could play with them. And I asked them at both stores, and they said they hadn't got the Frisbees in yet. But I did pick up a little badminton set. So I should have got two of them, because there's three girls and him. So uh, next time I go, I'll pick up another one. But um, they had them in blue and pink. I picked up the blue, so I guess I'll get pink next time. And I'll pick them up two sets. I got Libby Shay some flip-flops. She's had a growth spurt, so she grew out of all her flip-flops and sandals and all that. So I got her a little lemon pear, and this looks like a little, uh, um, what do you call it, mermaid. Mermaid um, tail uh, flip-flops. And I got her these little white, and I, I after I got to got them in the car I was looking at them they're got kind of a sparkly sole I think this is supposed to be part of their bridal collection but it's got a kind of a thick sole on it and they feel real solid these weren't now these right here were a dollar 25 these uh, the lemon and the mermaid ones but this right here was five dollars it was on the five dollar aisle so this is her, but they're more solid. They're more substan substantial, like a real sandal. And then I got these for Curtsy. She likes black and navy blue and stuff. So I got this and hers were also $5. And then I got these for Brentley. I hope these fit her, if not, Ashley can wear them. Ashley wears a nine and Brentley wears a 10. And this says that it's a nine ten. But to me, they look like Birkenstock, so I thought she might like these. Those were kind of cute. So all of them got sandals, and Kirk's got two pair of little flip-flops. These were at the checkout. The girls are forever needing chapstick, so I got this uh, Vaseline Rosy Lips. I got two of those. And uh, I got this little notepad to keep in my purse. I'm forever needing to jot stuff down. But I, I thought this little tin was cute. It comes with a little pen and a little notepad. And it has a floral thing on it. It's pink and blue. And it says, give it to God. I thought that was pretty. So I'll go ahead and plop that in my purse. Then I just picked up some knockoff Sensodyne. It's the sensitive uh, whitening. Is it the whitening toothpaste? It just says extreme by natural white compared to Sensodyne. So I got two of those. And then I just got these to restock the cabinet. Icy Blast and Crystal Mint. I didn't even know I got two different flavors, but I'll put these in the uh, little hall closet in case anybody needs, you know, extra toothpaste. So I got two different kinds. They can get whatever. Got these. Um, got this mainly for Libby Shay. She loves watermelon. This was at the checkout, and it says sweet watermelon. So I'll put that with their chapsticks. <clears throat> got one for each bathroom. Dial coconut water and mango. Hand soap. And then I got this for the kitchen sink. Himalayan salt 
scent clean and gentle so my kitchen stuff is pink so that's why I got that one I didn't care what smell it was what fragrance I'm gonna try this I've never tried it before purple conditioner knocks out brassy tones and blonde and gray hair and as you can see I've got kind of white and gray running throughout my hair and I like to use a purple conditioner and I usually use Dove Silver but I put this on dry hair and let it set like a hair mask for an hour or two put a bag on my head uh, or shower cap and then I get in the shower and rinse it out sometimes the good stuff turns it a little tinge of lilac or purple but I like it I don't care it eventually fades but it takes the yellow and the brassiness out so for $1.25, I thought, shoot, yeah, I'll try this. So I got two of them, one for me and one for Ashley. She doesn't have a whole lot of gray hair, but she got a little bit. Tony loves Zest body wash. So I got him the Ocean Wave Scent and the Fresh Aqua. I think he likes the Fresh Aqua better, so I got him two of those. And I don't know if they've watered these down, because if you get Zest at Walmart, it's like 6 or $7, and these are $1.25. So, he, he can tell me if they've watered it down or whatever. If they have, I won't buy them no more. Livy Shay's got a birthday coming up. So, I just went down through the makeup aisle. She's turning, she'll be eight. So, I got her a couple of lip glosses. One is Paradise Pink and the other is Fruit Punch. So, I got her a couple of those that she can keep in her purse. I thought she would like this. It's Peach bubble tea you know they like that boba and it looks like it's got like the little boba thing on it it's peach bubble tea lip gloss no sugar i'm sweet enough is what it says so that's a key so three lip glosses and a couple of uh, chupa chupa chups you know them lollipops from mexico they had uh two different kinds a watermelon mix which watermelon's her favorite and strawberry swirl and she loves strawberry too so i got two of those so she's got five different lip products that she can keep in her little purse that she totes around with her so i'll put those up for her little birthday and i picked up tony some sweets he'll put these in his nightstand drawer he doesn't he's cut back on his sweets a lot so uh, i'll put these down in a gallon ziploc baggie and he'll open these up and just keep it and he'll get him one when he wants it. But I got him some mini Kit Kats, mini Baby Ruth, and mini Butterfingers. And then some York Peppermint Patties and some Reese's Paint Butter Cups. Not, and he'll keep those in his nightstand drawer. I don't like stuff like that to be left out in the kitchen or anything. Cause like I said, I don't want to be tempted. And these are like those, uh, I think they're called Tagalongs, I believe. The Girl Scout cookies that are the chocolate-covered peanut butter wafers. This is kind of like the Dollar Tree brand. They're just, like I said, they're $1.25. I don't, I don't know. We've gotten them from the Dollar General before, but never from the Dollar Tree. So, if he likes these, I'll keep uh, him in these. He, he does like cookies. He eats a lot of cookies. He, uh, with his coffee in the morning. He's like Ashley. Um, he'll eat three or four or five of these and then take his morning medicine. He's not a big breakfast eater. and he, Or he'll eat some of these Nikot, I guess that's how you pronounce it, um, peanut butter and crackers. So <clears throat> he likes something sweet with his coffee or peanut butter and crackers. And then for, uh, this is, it's for all the girls, but the one that eats these every single day is Kirksey. Kirksey loves freezer pops or ice pops. So the, I saw these. They had the Skittles, the Starburst, and um, the Sonic. I didn't notice this, but that this box is kind of yucky and sticky. I, hope, I, I guess one was busted. It doesn't look like this box is busted, but it looks like something leaked on this one. So, I'll put these in the freezer for, for the girls, but mainly, like I said, for courtesy. I checked, and I didn't have any parchment paper, and I'm wanting to make that cottage cheese wrap. 
uh, today where you whoop up the cup of cottage cheese and two eggs and you bake it on parchment paper. So I bought these two at the Dollar Tree. I always buy my parchment paper there. And uh, Ashley's been baking a whole lot of cookies and stuff for the girls and I guess she used it all. And I love this cleaner, this Fabuloso. I either like the lemon kind. My favorite is the orange kind, and they didn't have it. It's got a little picture of an orange on it. They didn't have it today. but they, And I love the purple one, whatever it's supposed to be. But they had this lemon one. And um, I don't get that antibacterial. It doesn't smell as good for whatever reason. Oh, this smells so good. It smells like you have just squeezed a lemon. It smells that good. So, like I said, we got some birthdays coming up. Ashley's is July the 11th, and uh, Libouche's is uh, July 31st. So, uh, I like to buy this kind of stuff at the Dollar Tree. It's cheaper. So, I got some ribbon, and I got a couple of bows. Um, I like these a lot for Libouche, and I'll probably use these for Ashley. Um... And I bought these. Ashley doesn't like dark chocolate or milk chocolate. She likes white chocolate. And I saw these little kisses. So I'm going to put that down in one of her bags. So I just picked that up for her. And I bought us some more scotch tape. Because I think we were running low after Christmas. And um, there was a couple of books. Ashley, if you're watching this, you better turn it off. Or you're going to ruin your birthday surprise. A couple of them. But they had this real food for real people by Michelle Smith. And it's supposed to be about, you know, cooking and eating whole foods. And it's a hardcover uh, cookbook. It has a lot of stories and stuff in it. But I thought this was a really nice book for $1.25. So that will be one of Ashley's presents. And Ashley likes to cook in the air fryer. So they had this little book. Might give her some ideas. So I picked up that one. And um, I bought some pretty uh, tissue paper. Some of it's got like botanicals and stripes and stuff. And then I bought some of the glitter, which I might have some. I just picked it up just for the, I keep it in a, uh, it's kind of like a bookcase. Uh, it's got drawers in it, but I've got two drawers of di different kind of birthday stuff. And I bought some bags. Party time. If you're not buying your bags from the Dollar Tree, I don't know what you're doing because they're four and five, six, seven dollars at Walmart, depending on the size. I've never got one for less than four dollars at Walmart, and all the bags at the Dollar Tree are dollar twenty-five. So I got this one that says party time, and this one is glitter and just regular on the other side. You know, those that's pretty. And this one's kind of like that gradient. I thought that was real pretty. Got that one. So that's two glitter ones. And then a tie-dye one. Ashley likes tie-dye. And got another party time. I guess I got one for each of them. Ashley and Libby Shay. And then I got a couple of big ones. Because I haven't really done a lot of birthday shopping. But I don't know how big their, their presents are going to be. So in case I needed big ones. I got this one that says happy birthday. With this. Flamingo, I guess that's what that is on it. And this one, other one with happy birthday and a cake. I guess that one will be for Libby Shea. It's got balloons and stuff. That one will be for Ashley. But I just restocked on some bags in case we needed them. Because we definitely have birthdays coming up in July. And then August, we have Brentley's birthday. So, you know, you always need that kind of stuff. And if I go ahead and have it on hand, I won't feel you know, so rushed or whatever and be spending more at Roses or Dollar General or wherever. So, uh, I guess that's it. I don't think, I don't think I have anything else to show you. Um, but that's not my whole Dollar Tree haul. I appreciate you watching. I hope you turn, tune in next time. And until the next video, I will see you later. Thanks. See ya. Bye-bye.